Hello ladies and gentlemen, sorry for the delay there. Welcome back to part two of The Walking Dead. So we're continuing on with this episode, episode one where we left off just there now. Um, United have just won and they've beaten Southampton 9-0, which is fantastic. Um, so yeah, we're going to continue off. I didn't think I'd be coming back to play this, so I thought I was going to leave this till Thursday, but um, I don't think there's too much left in this part, so... I kind of want to just line it up for Thursday that we can just go straight into episode two and, and take it from there. So uh, let's kick off where we left off. Let's go. Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine and, well, yeah, we're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out of won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Okay. Order of business. Pills from pharmacy. Let's see what Glenn is up to. Give yeah. me some plasters I or something. some snacks. I'm cool. Not much of an appetite. Maybe save it for one of the kids? Alright, relax, Glenn. You know. Um, yeah, what's your story? story? I deliver pizzas around here. I brought a couple to the Everts a few times. Sorry, I mean the folks that own this place. Just really good people. It sucks seeing this place like this. Isn't that the truth? Ain't that the truth, Root? What's your next move? I don't know. I mean, you guys seem okay. What about your family? Yeah, I... I... Forget it, man. That's your business. I hate feeling like I can't do anything. I know the feeling, man. Back to the motor in. How can it be that bad so fast? You know, when things are taken away, people do crazy shit. I guess. But that's not me. I'm not giving up. Not for anything. Good, man. Good. You let her do it, you know. You said give her the gun. I know I did. Why the hell would you do that? She didn't want to live. She would have found a way to end it. I... I guess. You can't make someone fight. We gave her the least painful option. Try to get some rest. Huh. <laughs> yeah, right. Right. How are we going to get this guy's medication? Um, did she get that radio working? this thing guys is my stream working I can't seem to get it up on my phone uh, we found a lot of e energy bars and stuff here I've been finding some stuff to eat oh uh, thanks you're welcome are you sure your girl doesn't need it oh. okay it is working yeah, right. she might I suppose yeah give it to her I can take care of myself okay Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? No, I do not. <laughs> well, not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Wait, Jeff. Yeah. Uh, not now. Not right now. All right, let me know if you want to. Right. I need to figure out how to open this, um... Oh, no. Family pick. this no I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead guards oh there's another bat battery sweet should be able to give her the batteries right let's have a look and see I think we can yeah and here's another one should be able to get it to work now Sweet. Did you get it working? Hey, Connie. It's 
story of the century here, huh? Yeah, and I've got shit for recording equipment. And from the looks of it, there isn't going to be any shortage of first-hand accounts. You do radio? That's right. Well, until some piece of shit politicians yank our funding, and I hit the blogosphere. <laughs> it's still not working? Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me have a look at that thing. Go ahead. Right, you put the batteries in, right? <laughs> I, well, I hope she did. Flip it over. Right, she put them in. Good on ya. No, no, no. Okay. Was I meant to do that? <laughs> there you are. She's an idiot. <laughs> you had them in the wrong way around, you dingus. The station is okay. In the event of a full uh, uh, my, my producer's telling me we have to get off the air. Steve. Guys, I don't know. I think we go. I think we go out. Want to go have a look around outside? Yeah, I kind of do, man. Let's have a look around. Let's have a look okay. around. Why not? Why not? We need to break in, man, to the... Um... Oh, no. It's not good. Just eat. As far as I can tell, that's all they care about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. Um, there's a lot of them, right? Um, hold on, I'm just actually figuring out how to get the, uh... Oh, fuck it, we'll figure it out as we go. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. They gotta be out there, man. Have to be. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I can't reach that brick. Why can't I reach the brick? Think you can do anything with this? It's a TV remote. I used to fiddle around with stuff like that when I was a kid, but there's not much to do with it now. Man, I miss my robots. <laughs> Why did you just get anything you can do with this? Hello. Alright, let's have a look. Maybe there's something on the ground we can pick up. What? So that's dog. Take brick. Why can't I take the brick? I can't reach that brick. Any idea where the pharmacy keys might be? We searched high and low inside before you guys got here. They weren't on the old couple we took out of the office. So they aren't. Are you okay? They aren't in here. I'm the fine. keys. If the keys aren't in the drugstore. I think they could be out of here. We now live in a world where getting up and walking away is an actual possibility. So. Right. Anything else, Doug? How'd you end up here? I moved here to live with my uncle. He does tech stuff and it just made sense. So you're local. You probably knew the owners of this place. No, not really. I've only been here a couple months and I spend a lot of time. On the computer? No, just doing my own thing. What about you? Okay, so maybe there's someone. Where could the keys be, man? What's it matter? I guess it doesn't. Something like this happens, I suppose. 
All that matters is where you are, not how you got there. That place is full of TVs and electronics. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? What is he doing? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. I just hope the power is still on. You can just do that? How does he do that? Codes when I was in AV. Let's try. No freaking well, way. Done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? I got a few of them to take notice. Nice. But not enough. Okay, what next? Who's this? It's that over there. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. I just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. Don't Wouldn't you worry. Long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Yeah, this thing right here. It's called a brick. brick. Why can't I reach the brick, man? Awesome. Now to distract those things. His arm could have literally gone through there. Uh, we're going to open this. Just be careful. Right now, I can reach it, apparently. Go on, go on. Go and get it. Nice. Easy work. Now's the time. Is his brother still down over there? Let's go get him. Be careful. Uh. Keep an eye out, will you? Ah, uh, shit. Shouting. Fucking need you. I mean, you know what I mean. Ah, oh, come on, you don't. Why didn't it allow me to aim for the head? Aim for the head! Oh my god, this is stupid that it wants me to hit here. Fuck's sake. There we go. Sorry it took so long. Do you have those keys by any chance? Thank you. Holy crap! <laughs> of <Run>! course. <laughs> of course. He actually startled them by saying, Holy crap, bro. <laughs> Dickhead, man. Oh, now that gate is gonna be.
gonna be jeopardized now. Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. It's all that matters. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get in there. Yeah, Bako, this is amazing. It's good fun, I have to say. There's some parts where I'm just like, what is going on? Like, oh shit, I did not mean to do that. Uh, I'm still figuring out the buttons and stuff, and uh, you really have to be on time as well with your, um, with your hits as well when you're facing zombies. But it's cool. Oh no. Shit. We gotta hurry. Why is there an alarm on? For fuck's sake. That's annoying, man. We are fucked now. She's got a screwdriver right in the right in the shoulder. Sake. Yeah, they're so creepy, man. I love how the store is just called drugs. <laughs> it's just called drugs, like. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. Guys, that door's not locked anymore. Shit! You three, get on it! I'll get back as fast as I can. He's just gonna run off. Wait, how can I help here? Oh, shit. Hey, Lee. We don't make it through this. You should know that... Great guy. And there's some of them that's tiring at Rebecca. Glan is there. Herschel was there earlier. I should know what? Huh? I should know. Are you sure? It's based off the comic book universe, Rebecca, but it's not exactly the same story, you know. Okay. Oh, I got to play as Clementine, do I? Oh, I thought I did there for a second. Go on, Clementine, find something. I got this. I don't got this. Come on, come on, Lee. Oh, thank you. Hopefully that holds. Oh my god, this fucking Egypt. What do you need your purse for? Right, who do I save? She's got the gun. He's got... Fuck all. I think I go for the chick. She is a moron. Come on. Safe dog, safe dog, safe dog. Ah, you. <laughs> fuck dog. Fuck, fuck dog, man. He's wearing fucking Jesus sandals. Not cool, dog. Not cool. Save her. Get the screwdriver. I kind of want to finish her off, but we'll just run. No way! Did he? No. Thank you, Kenny. Especially a good friend. Man, Kenny, back away! Back away, Lee. Yes.
Kenny is a legend. Saved her butt. Kenny Rogers, yeah. <laughs> Rip. Right. Let's console Glenn. Is he all right? With uncountable severe emergencies in all counties, Georgia's cities and their current level of disaster are as follows. Atlanta, stage 9 catastrophe. Augusta, stage 9 I think I need to go. Columbus, stage 9 Yeah. I got friends there. And I just oh, no can't way. stay here knowing that they could This is where he goes city. off. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening. No way. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Oh, this is cool. So you kind of run into them on their journeys, it seems. So obviously Lee has his own journey and Glenn obviously goes off to find Rick and stuff. That's cool. Isn't it? Go, Glenn. Gotta do your thing, man. Find your friend. Thanks, dude. This is cool. Because I'm actually walking. I'm actually yeah, watching The Walking Dead at the moment. On season 6 at the moment. You guys be safe. We'll try. And Lee, you know, if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up. Like the girl from upstairs. Are you just going to let them? You told Carly to give her the gun. Yeah, I did. Maybe you were right. Glean. Like <laughs> anyway. You and Jenna did a perfect impersonation of that, actually. A Glean. <laughs> accent is spot on right so he's off on his pizza pizza car um, we can go over and thank Kenny for his, hey for his help call back there thanks for picking me up no problem we have to take care of each other yeah we do you said you wanted kids once uh, I did yeah well she's not your daughter so you can't <laughs> yeah, treat her Maggie's like Maggie's accent is. exactly yeah I know that but you can Gillian. Hell, maybe better than a father even could. Thanks, Kenny. I got your back, pal. Cheers, Ken. Top, top man. A little look around here. What else is around here? Let's go over to Carly. We saved her. I think these doing? might have a little thing. I'm okay. A little yeah, spark. Considering. I do. Yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We could have Doug. saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. What? You'll be alright. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Anyway... <laughs> just consult her. You'll be alright there. I understand. Not about her. Wait. Lee? What is it? Can you just look How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. Because you had the gun. I thought you needed the help. Ah, that makes sense. But it wasn't a choice like that. It, it was just something I did. I don't know why. <laughs> I just wish we both. I saved her you. because I could see how too, see how this goes, you know. Lee and Lee and Carly. She sounds sounds like a good match. She was into Jesus sandals, though. Oh man, check this out! The Jumatron had this mini gun on his shoulder. It's all Fuck him! I thought Super Dinosaur was toast. But you know what? We'll get to you next, Chief. Oh, and then. Hey Duck, uh, you want to cool it for a minute? 
Okay, sorry. I remember when I packed them up, I said... I'm sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. I was there. Yeah, you keep getting grabbed. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Oh, no. Glenn had the other one. Did you check the glove box? I swear... Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense. But it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Oh, you. Go deal with this. Oh, man. Clementine, another thing. The kid. What do you want? You like my daughter? Her dad tried to kill me, so... Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? Ah, oh, shit. I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what Why didn't he come and save his daughter? Dickhead. Daughter or that little girl you've got with you? <laughs> you watch your ass. Useless he is. Lee? Do you have a second? My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. Oh, this is her. Oh, yeah, I thought Carly was. Because of me. Was, you can't um, be like that. You're only one man. Her, his daughter. We're lucky to have you. Yeah, yeah. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls this through. This guy seems pretty smart. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. They're worse places to call home. Mm. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Yeah, I think so too. Ah, shit. <laughs> For fuck's sake, power's out. Hmm. What's happening? Next time on The Walking Dead. Right, let's have a little look. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. I thought you didn't I like want football. You to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. That is a manky energy bar, man. How are you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy. I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. Don't repeat what happened with the walkers at Herschel's farm. You choose the kids this time. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. Walkers don't worry about as much as the bears. Good luck with us! Now we're gonna take what we Oh no. There's too many of them! Ah! Oh! You never liked my dad. Even back at the drugstore when everyone thought Kenny Steve was fit, you went out of your way to side against him. This isn't happening. <laughs> this is wild. No more, please! No more, please! Oh shit. Oh shit. Right. I think we can end this here, right? Maybe. Uh, I just hope it's saved. Let me just double check. Um so you and 54% of players were honest, so it's given us a breakdown. So I lied to Herschel. Who would you... <laughs> Who did I save? I saved Sean, right? Okay. Defended Kenny, 54% defended Kenny. Gave Irene the gun. Who did you save? Doug or Carly? Hmm, very split down the middle. In terms of the, the decisions we made. Continue. Okay, well that 
does it for episode one. Um, obviously, we split this into two parts, but I will be back again on Thursday, guys, for um, episode two. Um, I look forward to seeing you all back. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed this series. And it's definitely something I'm going to do in the future because I want to see what happens, you know? Um, I'm just going to let this play out and then I'm going to end the stream. A lot of work gone into this. The cinematics are cool. I love the way it's kind of matching in the comic book design as well. Um, it was cool that we got to see Glenn's kind of intro and what he was doing actually before he went to Atlanta. Um, interesting. Interesting take on it anyway. Rebecca, thanks very much for tuning in and dropping the like. Really do appreciate it. Um, but yeah, make sure you watch part one, by the way. And my FIFA one. You have to watch the FIFA one. The FIFA one was good tonight. Um, but on that note, guys, I'm going to wrap it up here. Talk to you all soon. Adios.